My name is Dr. Mvuria Mgala. I'm the director of the Institute of Computing and Informatics. The bedrock of uh, IT and ICT courses. So we have courses uh, ranging from certificate all the way to PhD. Uh, certificate in uh, information, communication technology and maintenance. Uh, we have uh, two diploma programs that is Diploma in Computer Science and we have Diploma in Information Communication Technology. Then we also have three programs, uh, bachelor's programs. We have a Bachelor of Science in Computer Science. We have Bachelor of uh, Technology in Information Communication Technology. And we have Bachelor of Science in Information Technology. Then we also have a higher course that is a master's, master of science in information technology and a PhD in information technology. Now, because of the uh, COVID pandemic, uh, many universities have had to go uh, ODEL. Now, ODEL simply means uh, uh, distance learning. That means students cannot come to the university. They have to learn using a learning management system. Now, this is an automated uh, application or software where the learning is automated and students can access uh, the lecturer's content from where they are. They can uh, uh, interact with the lecturers uh, uh, virtually uh, from where they are and they can do assignments and submit them from their homes. All right, we'll, we'll do a demonstration shortly, but uh, most of these applications are very simple indeed. If you have access to a smartphone and you are able to use applications with a smartphone, uh, 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 that should be even more difficult than assessing the learning management system. First and foremost, you must access our website. Once you have switched on your computer, this is what we call the URL, or the position where you can type the URL, uh, uni Unified Resource Locator. So you will type uh, tomb dot sc dot ke now that is the unified resource locator for finding the two website so once you have typed just press the enter key on your laptop or computer and you will open the website uh, for two now on this website Go to the first menu in the list. It's written e-learning. So click that e-learning. And at this point, you'll get to this uh, stage where you have to, uh, you have been prompted to enter your username and your password. So at this point, you enter your registration number without slashes. For example, I can enter one here uh, for a student, DCS, DCS, that means Diploma in uh, uh, Computer Science, right, 2020. So DCS 056J. 2020. Now the, the the password is similar to the uh, the username in this case. So again, you type, but of course you will not see. So you have to type DCS uh, 05 6 J 2020. Okay. Then you press on the login button. Now, that will take you to the learning management system. 
So at this point, you should see your name. Like for this particular student, uh, the name is Lururi Mary Ann. So at this point, all you need to do is to click on the first menu. This is called a, this, a list of items in computing are called menus. So you click on the menu uh, uh, name written dashboard. So once you click on it, you will see, you will open the courses, but they may not appear. So you have to go to this icon or this menu called my courses. So when you click on it, you'll see all the courses that have been assigned to you. Like for this particular student, there are seven uh, uh, courses that have been assigned to, to her. So if you want to start reading on any of these uh, uh, units, you simply go to it and click on it. And you'll be able to see uh, the content here. Now for this particular course, the lecturer is going to load in the, the material, but you will see the word announcement. When you click on this announcement, you will see uh, uh, details of maybe when you'll do the first cut, when you'll do the second cut, when you'll submit assignment, uh, and such like things. Then you have to go when you want to begin learning now, you go, to, you go and click, for example, topic one. Eh? So when you click topic one, then the content will open and you start learning. So it is that simple. There is hope uh, for all the first years. One is that this COVID is not here to stay. So soon it will come to an end and you'll be able to come to the university and uh, have face-to-face -face interaction with the lecturers. Uh, two, the learning management system uh, and online learning is a, is a new normal, which has been adopted elsewhere in the first world. And this, uh, this uh, situation has helped us to make uh, is it a frog jump uh, so that you can be uh, be able to use this technology and it will save you a lot more. So welcome to the online learning. Thank you.